Hello everybody, it's the Cornish Ratbeard here, bringing you a yet another video of our Star Trek New Horizons playthrough. Um, so in the last episode, we managed to get Betazoid and all their planets into our Federation, which is pretty awesome. So that's come along quite nicely, as well as get ourselves into a new coalition with quite a lot of different species that we can start to snap up and paint them all blue on the map. Um, so we're going to carry on from where we left off. We've got a few things up here that I want to go through. So we've got a relic we can do, the time crystal or the mask of Masaka. Um, the passive effects is plus one unity. Well, that's not too bad, but I'd rather go for this time crystal one and attempt some rare experiments. See what comes from that. So we'll do that. So we've got some research to do. Let's upgrade the civilian. That will give us some more ships, I think, in the civilian style. Also, quickly, we went. I went through the planets quickly before I started recording. And we have got a serious amount of depots. Naval supply depots. Uh, I mean, I've never seen this many spawn us to be able to use so this is going to be going up considerably what have we got here that, that okay luxuries we are short on luxuries so we will have to look into getting some more of those guys maybe possibly through some trading networks i think i've got a trading network here yeah i do so um i think it's being upgraded at the minute isn't it set policies to move Okay, this one, yeah, we can do it. So import luxuries. So hopefully that will go up a little bit more. I'm not too sure what it is. I think what's happened here is is that because we've taken on Betazoid, all their planets are taking up quite a lot of the luxury. So here, like this. So what we need to do is demolish a lot of them if not all of them, because that's a lot of luxuries that it's taking up, right? Um, the science, get rid of a couple of those, because they take luxuries as well. So let's just have a quick look at what's tanking that. If we just look at the planets, we can tell straight away. Maybe it was just that one. Okay, there's some here. Let's demolish some of those. The administration districts, I mean, we can get them back, right? But let's just not be in the red. Is there any more? You. I mean, if we dramatically increase in the luxuries, then I will add a few more back. It's no biggie. Really, I'd like to do it to the science more than the administrative. Let's get rid of that. And you. Okay, let's see where we are after I unpause it. So, yep, XP, time projects. Okay, so we've got a diplomatic conference to sort out on Romulus. Um, and what does it want? A scientist. There is a scientist here. And you want to go to Romulus, no problem. So, you can do that. Uh, our fleet. So look, our fleet's looking good. Where are you two? You're up there and you're down there. So this place, you're building it. Right, so I might start a fleet here. So, I mean, all I need to do is I could just build a frigate and then build onto that, I guess. Just so we've got a fleet going there. Right, let's unpause and let's carry on and see what we got going on. Okay, there's a science ship here not doing a lot, but we want to go down here. So let's go to this system. Um, how did our luxuries do? It hasn't changed yet. But I'm sure it will in a second. Oh, excellent. So let's see what the results will be. They're going to be there shortly. Orders closed, fleet upgraded, orders open. More research. Um, de assimilation. Yeah, let's start that. 
we also did have some more minor civilizations which we could start getting into the federation there's one there so that will become their own sector and one there um you know i don't see what the problem is we might as well just go for it and get that done so let's start that the initiation fleets well it says I can upgrade, but I can't yet, because I'm probably quite low on alloys and some other various little things. Uh, looks like we've sorted out the luxuries. There you go, plus 17. Let's keep it like that for now. Right, that frigate is building. Anything we can sell? We will begin the session talks in a minute. Let's have a look here. Really a great deal. I mean, let that grow, that alloy. I mean, 112 each time, each month. That's pretty good. Right, let's have a look. Potential members. Who do we want to bring in straight away? One of these. The Zindi. Where's the Zindi? Around here. Are they Zindi Council? Is that them? Yeah. So, what, who are these guys? I think maybe these guys, well actually they're pretty big right, look. Wow. Look at it all. So if we bring them in that's going to turn a lot of things blue. So we'll wait because we don't want to completely overcrowd our empire sprawl do we? So let's go for the little ones. The Bolians, where are they at? There. Um, the Saurian? Sarian. I'm not sure where they are. But at the Packlid. That's cool. So. What we could do is go with the Bolian. Because, I mean, they're right there. So let's get them in. Let's go high. Right, continue that. So we'll wait, we see that we get a new fleet here. And then we're going to go to town on it. How is our planet's looking? Pretty good. Yeah, migration. Totally. Let's go for a farm. Keep that food coming in. Yeah, I've got some cities being built here, so no problem. Let's get some alloys upgraded though after that city and I'm leaving some space open just to get some sort of like Research one of a kind completed. buildings in there as soon as you go into your home planet okay let's get that one the assimilated one um, you're looking good here so you have a special buildings look another naval supply depot it's just a crazy amount of them I've never seen so many so I'm thinking a farm because the obvious reason we are low on food. Okay, let's get rid of that, get rid of that. Right, we have our new fleet there. So let's pop down this way to it. I'm going to upgrade star bases as well, but I really want my alloys for this. Yep. Fleet manager. Oh, hang on. There's things to do that are more important right now. Okay, home territory fire rates increased. Yes, we want that. I like that tree. The diplomacy tree is quite good, really, isn't it? Um, let's try again. Fleet manager. Let's add some ships. So we want. Come on, guys! Look what you're doing to me here. I'm gonna have to pause it, aren't I, while I quickly do this? There we go. Right. Let's go for ten of you. I do like to have ten of those Litlins running around. A couple of these light cruiser fours. One heavy cruiser and one advanced. Wow, that's pretty much the fleet done. Alright, well we'll do that. And should we assign them a leader? Oh, I reckon you Terrell. 
you might have the job for now. Okay, now this is going to be like the Klingon defense fleet. So, reinforce that straight away and let's get some ships being built there. Now, let's carry on, guys. Come on. What notifications have you got for me? Nothing really interesting. Do we have edicts that need doing? I mean, we've got loads of influence, so... Ecological? I'm going to go for that because that's good because that there sorts out our supplies. So it's on plus 12, now it's plus 27, so that's pretty good. Um, what's this do? Courage free fort. Map the stars. Fleet focus. Well, that's good. We'll be using that in the future. Even bigger one. Right, next stage shield. Yeah, let's do the shield. What have we got? Right, okay. So we can upgrade. Let's upgrade the second fleet. Should I rename these? I mean, I want to rename that, really. I want that... Can I rename it? Yeah. I want that to be the first. Let's name that... First fleet. Um, I already had a first fleet, but that's fine, because it's not the true first fleet, is it? You can be second. And you're going to be my third. Third fleet. There, that looks a bit better. Okay, we're getting quite a lot of alloys in now. So let's just keep upgrading our fleets. For the mean the time being. Um, have a look at our map. We are pretty much all filled in now. Thanks to our massive coalition we got. The Borg, how are they doing? I mean, are they doing their thing over here? Upgraded. I expect they are. I'd like to see him get a bit bigger. Because I wouldn't mind having it out with them in the near future. Okay, we've got a scientist. He's he's on his way there. Everyone's overwhelming. What about you, Cardassians? Yes. yes. You are. Okay, you're equivalent now. So that makes me feel a little bit better. Alright. Um, commercial complex. Yeah. Constitution class. Now that's what we want, right? Let's see if we can get the Enterprise out. About time. Um, that was my alloys. Not great. We're getting a couple of the frigates in there. This is upgrading, right? Um, the star base itself, yeah. What can I have here? I'll probably get like a defense grid and that for this place. Like here. Upgrade that now, yeah. So, so what does the, uh, one second, what does the upgrading cost? Is that the plates? Have we got a place here that needs upgrading? Um you so it costs okay it costs those of plates that's fine because we've got loads of them so is there any star bases that need an upgrade no you can tell by the symbol here on the left we've got the ones upgrading hang on here's one all oh, right yeah yeah you're already upgrading you're upgrading you're upgrading rest is upgraded okay good let's keep those alloys coming in Let's keep it going. Construction ship, science ship. So what size is that? That's not bad. I mean, that's a 3k. What can we do? Yeah, let's do that. So everything's pretty good up here, apart from our food. Um, there's nothing really 
I want to sell right now to get some more alloys. I mean, we're we're making quite a bit of, bit of buck there, so let's have a look, see if our buildings are doing okay. Okay, we've got one here. Um, any special buildings? No. So let's go farm. And what does it take? It takes to do this. Okay. How are we doing on those? We're doing really well. So I'm going to get a couple of districts. A couple of farm districts. And and just make this place into a bit of a bit of a farming place. What about here? You're a resort location. You're not much of a resort location without food, are you? So you can have some food. Gem. You've got a city going on. Let's get you a heritage museum. Um, Earth, you're fine. You're doing my alloys. Good. Right, no problem there. Okay, everything's looking good. Alloys, yep, keep them going. I want to get some of the big ships, if I'm honest. I know they're going to cost a bomb, aren't they? How much do they cost? Oh, hello. Hidden dealings. Okay, so it looks like a disease. Kill the disease and provide a larger amount of medical supplies. Absolutely. Try that. Any of course. Of them. Yep. Migrate. Come on over to my planet. So I've got plenty of them waiting for you. So let's go down to the fleet a minute. The third fleet. Fleet manager. So an advanced cruiser alone and a heavy cruiser, they're costing quite a lot. Excellent. We did what we could. We always will. So as we have got the new constitution class coming, there's no point building this heavy cruiser because I think the new heavy cruiser will be the new constitution one. Um, so that's probably a good idea to just knock them out and it's already built it now. Heavy cruiser. There we go. What can we do now? Let's let's do that. Research. Um. Yeah, let's go for the ethics pool. Right, shield technology breakthrough. What do we want? Covariant shields or regenerative? Can you provide more info? Right, so the covariance. I recommend these shields if you plan to focus mostly on short, decisive engagements. Regeneratives, well, if you plan to rely on a fleet of larger, slower vessels, which will result in longer military engagements. Yep, because again, we have big old ships. Um, let's go for the power hub, carbon reaction, fusion, power core. Sounds good to me. What's a failure? That, oh, okay. Should we, let's offer them some compensation. What happened? I take it he didn't get there. Well, he did get there, actually, but I don't think he, he had a good time of it. So let's keep him on our side for a minute. While we can afford it. Uh, I'm not going to let them bully me, but let's concentrate on... Let's get these new shields up. That's what these upgrades will be. No doubt about it. Okay, we've got a slot here. How are we doing? Looking good up there. So, let's go for an academy. Let's keep that science going. I mean, our scientists are looking pretty good. We've got Noonan Soon. And our Hoshi. And this guy, Gallo. Flagship construction. A new long range exploration vessel is ready for construction. Utilizing experimental technology and enhanced engineering. Excellent. So, okay, let's. 
Here we go. The Starfleet Event Starship Design Bureau have advised us a new ship design is available to construct at the Utopia Plan Planitia Fleet Yards. So I haven't done this. Yeah, I thought that the heavy cruiser, I knew that was going to be that. Um, let's review you and let's get you in high. Let's pause it for a second here. Let's just do the research. Uh, events, force fields, yeah. Right, so I guess we're going to need to go to Seoul and find our fleet yard. So if we click on it here, I believe, display available flagships, the Constitution class, lovely. Yep, we know what it is. It's good for its five year trips. Display available starship designs. Display available civilian designs. Uh, what? So, this one? United Earth era ships. That's a discovery. Oh, cool. We can make the discovery. Again, I'm not sure how we get it going though. Display available. What type of flagships can we build? We can design our flagships to be science and military. Yeah. Display available. Well, how do I do it then? The event happens. Constitution class cruiser happens. Okay. So it's just going to happen. Right. I get it now. So we we'll wait for that to happen and see where that takes us. Hopefully it, it gets it done. Right, so let's add in the Constitution, Constitution class. This one. Have I added that in? Yeah. Great, okay. And um, we did get an advanced cruiser built here. Um, we can do it here, so let's go to the second fleet. Let's add in one of those again there. And the third fleet. Let's add that in. And another light cruiser. Oh no, we can't. But that's okay. That will be quite strong still. Right, nice. We can't upgrade. How is our third fleet looking now? It's getting a bit bigger. A bit stronger, it's already at 1.2k. Alright, so you're chilling up there, but you you can come back now. Oof. Didn't know what you said, but... Right. Um, yes, science ship. Come back and just do science there. Luxury hotel and interstellar market, yeah. Look, we're only on the minus one now with the food, so that's going quite well. Let's have a look up here quickly. A naval supply depot. Yeah, why not? I mean, let's keep that going, right? Can't ever have too many ships. And an academy. Anything up the top end? Yes, unemployment. You are building that, so you should be okay. Grab a farm anyway. An earth. Yeah, you've just got some spots for us to save. Look, this Taichu Laboratories here. We need to upgrade our city, our capital. And then we can use that. Right, let's speed up a notch, just for the meantime. We can add some more. So, I'm thinking maybe we should take both fleets down here. And let's take out, or we'll try to anyway. Let's try to take out this, so if we got some stuff in place, Hopefully this is not a disaster like it was the last one. Where are you? You're miles away. You're close by. So let's get you over here. 
Do we have a science ship close by? Yeah, we do. Um, we're going to go for it. So, well, we're going to see what it's all about anyway. If it's pretty deadly, we'll just retreat. Upgraded. Nice, you might be the only fleet left in a minute. Let's keep you upgrading for a second. How are they looking? Overwhelming? Yeah. yeah. That's quite cool though that they're all overwhelming because it gives us a challenge and they probably will declare war on us. Like I say, this is Grand Admiral, just to remind you all again. So, um, they sh Please, I'm doing really well f for them not to be hating me so much that we're at war right now. Terra Nova. Um, let's go for some food. Gonna need to start going for some energy soon. Right, some more traditions. That was fast, it's more like it. Trade value increase. Yep. Ooh. Okay. Cardassia. Naughty, naughty. Look. Wishes to annex Vajor. I'm not gonna support that. So let's condemn this. Right, so a new three year mission awaits. I'm not gonna do it right now because last time was a disaster and I don't know, I don't know if I've even got anyone that's heroic right now. Let's double check on that. No. 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 I do still have Archer. So, I could send him out on one last voyage. So let's do it. That's what I say, let's do it. Right, let's send a scientist. Let's just knock this down a little notch. And where do you need to go, my friend? Okay, there, so where's Archer? Oh, Cardassia. Where are you? Okay. Oh, well, you're about to do that, though. But I'll get a new one on the go. So research that project. Is there another site to ship around? Perfecto. Okay. So let's get you over there. Cardassian Union has declared war on Bajor. It looks like the Baron World seeks to harvest the riches and make them its own. Well, good luck, Bajor. Would you like to join the Federation? Like, really quickly? <laughs> uh, I, could I could actually... I could get them into the... If I improve relations... I've got quite a few of these guys now that can relations so let's do that let's have the research agreement as well they already okay they are already associated with another coalition ah oh, what all right well okay and we'll gain straight and technology let's go for that um, productivity, yeah. Okay, so I've also got another. Who is we are ready? Who are we really bad relations with? It, Kardashians, we are really bad relations with. Not, not so bad. How are we doing with Romulans? Not as bad. So it is Cardassia. These guys. It's Cardassia that are likely to declare we are war, ready. if anyone. So let's send someone to improve relations with them. Trust me guys, this is definitely the way you want to play it as Federation for the time being. Um, let's carry that on. So we do have both of our fleets here. Right. Well, let's go for the Saladin class. Right, we've got both fleets. So let's go on in. Let's go on in. Let's see what happens here. Let's go for a grand finale on this episode. Here we go. Let's see what the system's going to be like. Oh, okay, quickly, quickly. University World. Here we come. Was there, right? Where are we? Here. Okay, oh, it's an entity, so 
I don't think we're going to take them out somehow. We do have already people here. Can I get... Okay, that's him. We've got you coming. You can survey the system. How am I doing here? This is going to die, that's the question. I don't think it is. These entities don't normally die very easily. We need to initiate a special project to learn more about these aliens. So, I'm going to pull these guys back. I'm going to have to retreat them here, am I? Yeah, let's, let's retreat them. Let's retreat them. I mean, it's, there's no point. It wasn't going anywhere. Ship's damaged one. We can live with that. No problem. So how do we initiate that special project? Do we need a scientist? Um, you know, something like that. Maybe we do. Maybe we've got to get a scientist up close to survey it. Gav. Administrator Gav. Alright. Let's have a look at him quickly. Gav. Soldiers, decision cost. Eh. I don't really think I need him right now, do I? Right, so, our fleets. So which fleet are you? Your first fleet. Why don't you now return home for a minute? And you're already home, right? Yeah. Yeah, you're already home. So let's keep this fleet going nicely. Are you on your way home or? Return. All selected fleets return home. So where is your home? Oh, you don't have one. Well, let's change that. That's now your home. I want you to protect return our home. Complete. Do you all have something? Yeah, you do. And you don't. That's you, I believe. Right, let's pause, get this done, and then we're going to call that an episode. Okay, let's go for the agricultural. Um, support drive, yeah. So we can get that other flagship. Oh, which we are still waiting for, actually. We need the uh, four collector to level. We need the flagship to start happening. We need that event to fire. Right, guys, that, I'm going to call it there for this episode. So I hope you enjoyed that one quick recap I guess then um, don't attack entities there's no point we're gonna have to go the scientific way I think to see what's going on there um, Cardassians will probably pick we that sector up but if they do then it's no biggie we we'll see what else is about I mean what we're about is inviting people into our Federation and that's how we start gaining our territory um, if we were the Klingons for example we would just do it via war which is a lot funner, but for you guys that want to know what, how the Federation deal with their territory expanding, this is the way we do it really. So um, anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a like and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye bye for now.